Hello, this is Oklahoma Cannabis Business Attorney Jesse Kovach at the OK Cannabis Law Office. Today we're going to be looking at microbial testing thresholds for medical marijuana products. Now, this is for products that are not metered dose inhaler products, that are not metered dose nasal spray products, they're not vaginal administration products or rectal administration products. So the vast majority of products, but outside of those categories, have a total of seven different microbial or yeast um, um, agents that you will need to test for. These are the total yeast and mold microbials, which must be uh, lower than 10 to the fourth uh, colony forming units per gram. And the rest of these must be less than one colony forming unit per gram. And these are Shiga toxin producing S. Cherichia coli, pathogenic salmonella SPP, Aspergillus flavus, Aspergillus fumigatus, Aspergillus niger, Aspergillus tereus. All of those need to be less than one colony former unit, colony forming unit per gram. And again, this is for the vast majority of products, but not including meter pressurized meter dose inhaler products, meter dose nasal spray products, or vaginal or rectal, rectal administration products. Now, if this information was helpful to you and you want to find more like it at our website, it's medicalmarijuana.attorney.